Hello and welcome back to Kelly 60 Plays. Metroid Samus Return of Sa Metroid 2 Return of Samus, not Samus Returns. I just realized I was saying Samus Returns the entire time. <laughs> I mean the map's kind of kind of the same in this area. Not really. Because <sighs> Pixels, how do they work? Okay. We need to head to the bottom of the area. Nah. I'm going straight right. Screw it. <laughs> I'm doing this one now. Actually, no. Nope. Now that I think about it, no. I'd rather get to the certain other things. Okay, now we're... There's hazards. And... Oh. Seriously. That small, small lag burst. God dang it. Okay, now, in this area we go left. Why? Why? Oh. Oh god. Ow. <laughs> and that is why I didn't go left. <laughs> or right or decided against going right earlier. Now, back here. Boom. This is also the other reason. So yeah, uh, that was our first Gamma Metroid. The evolved form of the Alphas we've been fighting for a bit. And what do we have to the right? There is a right corridor. Uh, in L in Samus Returns, though, this area is, uh, a magma corridor. Funny enough, because, guess what? All the items that are here are in their original positions. So it makes more sense to get the various suit in a fire corridor. And not a water corridor. And yes, that's just a normal alpha. In case you're wondering, though, if there is a missile recharge in this area, no, the closest missile recharge is technically the one at the beginning of the game. <laughs> <laughs> the one that sits after the first alpha is the closest missile recharge to this area. Yes. It sucks. Oh, hang on. <laughs> I just realized I went too far. And now to the right room. And you'll see exactly why I skipped it. <laughs> it's for the very reason that I went to the left. <laughs> Once we got hit the south area. Now this is in a much more dangerous spot than the southern corridor, though. And yes, the ga- uh... The Gamma Metroids like using electricity. 
No, they do not have tongues. <laughs> In fact, I don't think any <laughs> Metroid enemy in this game uses a tongue. I think the first major Metroid enemy would be with that attack type is Metroid 1? Me Super or Fusion? Well, Stone Toads. But anyways, uh, we just unlocked the third area. Let's go down and see what's there. I'm picking up 30 units of health. <laughs> and I'll take this path because I want my 30 units of health if I get lucky. Here we go. Hang on. Unlike certain developers I cannot m walk and shoot at walk and walk jump and also open a browser at the same time I'm getting my maps situated okay for area free I do remember where I need to go here ow <sighs> these guys come down so far So, area free makes life even easier, somewhat, and will be the first area I actually change my weaponry. Like, twice. And I l mean twice. Trust me when I mean twice. Uh, thankfully, nothing else changes. Yay! We got caverns again, and I'm <laughs> like... This game is really lacking on music. Like, Metroid's good with music, but... And yes... Every downward slope is a Z. Definitely... Uh, Serenus Returns definitely does this better. <laughs> But, as I mentioned earlier, or was going on about, essentially, if you know how Samus Returns works, or this game works, and went to, like, Samus Returns, you'd be fine both ways. AM2R! <laughs> Keeps most of the rooms, decides to screw you over later. <laughs> now, Samus Returns also does change up some rooms later, but that's for better effect. <laughs> Here, nope. <laughs> okay. If I remember correctly, there are no items in this version of the game. There is one in later. Okay, yep. And this is the reason, partially, why I'll be swapping weapons now, rather than later. Ow. 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 And remember, most most weapons in this game are technically optional. <laughs> so like the various suit I just picked up earlier is optional. I'm only coming this way for one reason and it is to save. There's a save room at the end of this tunnel. Followed by a long drop. We'll be dealing with anything that is on this side of the map later. 
which will include missing a certain item till much later than I'd want it to, even if it's only one weapon. Because at this point in the game, you can have access to... Ow. Every... Uh, beam weapon ever in Metroid. Just that they don't stack. Every time. Okay, I'm here. I need to go up and around. This. Oh. This lovely structure for a little bit. Technically, there is another save point later, but, ow, I'm going to be taking some hits. Ugh. <sighs> Door. Uh. <laughs> this item's first appearance in the Metroid franchise. <laughs> and yes, this is partially the reason I wanted to come this way first. <laughs> the, or the entire reason I wanted to come this way first. Down this pit. There it is. Oh. Just clipped the wall. And yes, this is when they start introducing these fake blocks that don't actually get destroyed. Down we go! Because there it We are about to get my next favorite item. Oh god. Nope, 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 nope. Ow. This is going to be our first of these in this uh, map. One, two, three, four, five. I'd, I'd go slow there just for that. Screw up my... Also, the first appearance of this in Metroid, the Spacer! And yes, it does have the Wave Beams effect. And it's a much better one at that too! <laughs> Ow. 
Uh, if you would like to know, do not go this way. Uh, if you are so much as hurting. Hi. <laughs> because going this way is another Metroid should you need to. You know what? Screw it. And yes, it's already triggered. And yes, if you're wondering, the space jump is, has always been this finicky. <laughs> How? <laughs> and yes, if you even so much as There we go. Ow. And remember, we still have that entire room to go through. <laughs> but I wonder. It seems to be a floor right here. Oh, missiles. And yes. This is the reason there are still walls here. <laughs> Like, spider ball should be useless. <laughs> oh. Okay. Now we're going to shoot straight up here. Oh. <sighs> and no, you can't just kill the thing. Good thing I saved. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. Thank God. I'd rather take free damage right there. <laughs> Let's see, where's the... If you're wondering, no, we're not getting that till later. <laughs> so yes, Spacer. Essentially the wave beam on... But it has what would be wave beams... Thing 
in later entries to the Metroid franchise, which would be the increased width in Zero Mission. <laughs> And yes. Oh. This one's a pain. <laughs> oh! <laughs> and yes, this one also exists. Ah. Uh. Yeah, so I went all through all that work for no reason. Get me out! <laughs> and before we finish this part, I'm gonna do one more thing. Yep! You thought you got away from him, didn't you? <laughs> Just fall straight down. There's not a single enemy, except... Oh, would you look at that? You, round two. Electric Boogaloo. <laughs> I actually prefer the Gammas in <laughs> the Samus Return, so these guys are, these guys are alphas on crack. <laughs> I say as I immediately kill him because he's stupid and got stuck on the wall. And... It I think this room is actually a homage to the original. Actually. I think the setup of the things are in fact the exact same as Torin. Right there. Oh. <laughs> yes, I hate the space jump. <laughs> no matter which entry it's in. The space jump can go. <laughs> well, it's much easier to do in Dread <laughs> to keep it sta stabilized. Here, not so much. Okay, we've killed two. We got both the space jump and the spacer beam, and we finished off the other four <laughs> from the other from area two. Next time we go on, we should be finishing this area. Because the only reason I came over here to this side was to get the space jump early. And if you're wondering if there's any way to get to the other areas from this direction. Technically there should be. But no. And trust me, there is still a lot more in this area, so I don't even think the next part will be it. But anyways, thank you all so very much for watching and stopping by to see this. Next time we meet, uh, we should be closer to being done with. Uh, Sam Return of Samus. And by closer, I mean closer to finishing this area. But, uh, because, uh... How many areas past this one? Just so I can get a timetable. What? 
Well, I'm not even going to count Area 4 because Area 4 didn't. Or Area 5. They're very small. Area 4 and 5 are essentially just one. Just one, two, three. One, two. Well, one, two, three, four. Five, six. Well, six is nothing. Seven. There are seven. Just to deal with. But anyways. Uh. Next time we meet. Uh. We're going to continue on. So thank you all so very much for watching and stopping by. This is K60 signing off. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I'll see you next time for more. Metroid 2 Return of Samus. Thank you all so very much for watching and stopping by. Take care. Stay safe. I'll see you next time. Bye!